love that song. This is perfect for this segment, too. Keeping your home warm this fall and winter could take a toll on your family budget. Households in the United States say their monthly energy costs rise from almost $96 in 2006 to an average of about $114 in 2014. That's a big old jump. But upgrades in home technology could help cut the cost. Lindsay Turrentine is the editor-in-chief of our partners at CNET.com, and she joins us at the table. So you're saying, hi, Lindsay. Good morning. So you're saying if you knew exactly where the energy was coming from, you could save money, and you brought a little handy-dandy gadget. I did. How and to do that. Right now, it's plugged into the lamp behind me. Okay. It's a remote switch, so think of it as sort of a timer, but it's got smarts, and there's an app on your phone. Load the app, and you can use the app to do a couple things. You can use it to control the lamp. Basic stuff here. On Turning it on and off. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, from wherever you are. It will work. <laughs> it worked. Good. Okay. I, I'm magical. Uh, you can do you that, can, or you can do this from anywhere. But what's really cool about this device costs fifty dollars. You can plug it in anywhere. So any product in your house, you can plug into it, and the app itself tracks your usage and tells you how much that product is using. Yeah. So you can use this app to make really smart decisions. There's a writer for CNET who used this plug and moved it all over his house. He found out that his house was using more energy than any other house in his neighborhood. Yeah. Yeah. And he decided he wanted to put an end to that. He ended up identifying some old appliances in his house, swapping them out and saving something like $850 a year. Whoa. Just yeah. by figuring out using this app, where that energy was being It's just fifty dollars. It's fifty dollars, so and you can buy multiple and, and control multiple devices with it, sort of like a, an advanced timer. It's got some cool features, like it'll randomize when your lights come on, so that you can confuse burglars. Mm -hmm. But it also mostly, and what I think is cool, lets you track the energy use. And if product. you waste at the heating in your house, so by the time you get that, it'll be warm. That's well, that's right. And you know, if you, there are lots of ways to control heat right. from a distance. Or and, reduce heat. Or reduce heat from a distance. We, uh, you know, in the CNET Smart Home, in all of our testing and projects, take a lot of look at thermostats. We've talked about Nest on this show before. There's some other cool devices. There's the Ecobee 3, which is a smart thermostat that has something that no other smart thermostats have, remote sensors that you can place around your house so that you can actually see where your rooms are hot or cold. What's the biggest drainer that we should just get rid of? Large old appliances oh, okay. are a huge drainer. So okay. you've probably been to the store, you've seen the, uh, the Energy Star rating labels. Got it. Those labels actually mean something. They mean that a gadget, a product, any device has been shown to save significant energy over time and that you should be able to recoup the cost of that new product relatively quickly. Okay. Yay, new appliances! The new appliances. The reason to buy new appliances. So if you've got an avocado refrigerator or something that's moon gold, it needs to go. It does, and that could save it. you, I mean, in, in some cases, that could save goes. you $50 a month. Well, got it. Swapping thank, out. The, thank you, Lindsay. You're thank always you. Good to always see good you. to see you.